Hey there and welcome to my channel. My name is Alicia and I'm a certified and licensed athletic trainer. In this video, I'm gonna be going over how to do an isometric tricep hold with a unilateral release and how you can modify it if necessary. So let's get started. Before we get started, if you're interested in using any of these exercises in the form of a workout program, be sure to check out my website at www.imomstrong.com. Now for this exercise, you will need a set of dumbbells and we are going to stand with our feet uh, about hip width apart. You're going to shift your weight back into your heels, slightly bend your knees, push your butt back, and you are going to draw the dumbbells up and do a tricep kickback. Now we are gonna hold this position and one at a time release the dumbbell and alternate sides. Really focusing on locking out those elbows just a little bit by squeezing the tricep muscle. So it's not a full lockout, I guess I should say. It's more focusing on squeezing that tricep muscle, which is this muscle right here in the back of your arm. Now this can be kind of hard to do uh, due to the long lever of the arm. So um, I'm using eight pound dumbbells here, but uh, it using a lighter dumbbell would be uh, potentially necessary. So that would be the modification would be to use a lighter weight. And just really focusing on squeezing those tricep muscles because those are the muscles that we are really focusing on here. And there you have it. That is how you do an isometric tricep hold with a unilateral release. Hopefully you're able to learn a little something from this video. And if you did, I would greatly appreciate it if you took a moment to like the video. And then for more exercises and how you can do them properly, you can head on over to my channel and subscribe there. Until next time, I will see you back here later. Bye guys.